is Sarah Sharp Fellows. My husband was Rear Admiral, upper half. That means two stars. Frederick Gale Fellows, Jr., United States Navy. We lost four people, two dead, the two, two dead pilots and two RIOs who spent the rest of the war in Hanoi. It was tough. But one week after they, the POWs came home in 1973, Bob and Becky Fant got married in the chapel at Oceana Naval Air Station with all of his squadron mates still there. And it was a really joyous occasion. And of course, Jack Fellows was home by then too. All to the good. In the end of, the, uh, end of Ted's um, tour as CO of VF-102, which has always been one of his most favorite commands, uh, he was called to Washington, which he had avoided up to that point, uh, strenuously avoided <laughs> up to that point. He uh, became the military aide and, and something, something to the Chief of Naval Operations, who was Thomas Moore. And it was a fascinatingly interesting couple of years. Uh, Carrie Moore, and uh, Emma Moore's wife, was one of the most delightful people you'd ever want to meet. She was really wonderful. And she was just almost unflappable. You know, things would come up that we'd, we'd be going to an embassy for something or other. And the boys weren't home from school. And they should have been home from school. And, but there were people there to help. They rounded up the kids. <laughs> so that she could do everything she had to do in a social sense. Um, Admiral Moore was, I, th I honestly think he was out of town more than he was in town. He was at various bases. He was talking with various commands. He was out uh, with Admiral McCain in the Pacific. Um, uh, John, John McCain was a POW by then. But, uh, that was tough. Um, we were there with Anna Moore for quite for, um, um, up until about 1970. Uh, then Ted got orders to become executive officer on the John F. Kennedy, the aircraft carrier John F. Kennedy.